the Western Conference Finals. The battle now goes to Game 2. Thank you for joining us for this playoff edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. Our broadcast team tonight, on one side, Greg Anthony. On the other side, Steve Smith. On the sideline, David Aldrin. Antonio. We've got Joe Ingles. Jakob Pertl out there with Antetokounmpo. Then there's Murray. And it's Oladipo in at the two guard. And for the Warriors, Andrew Wiggins is out there with Duncan. Then it's Curry. Then there's Bullock. And it's Poole in at the two. And it's going to be the Spurs off the tip. Now, on to Kumbo. Count that one. You just love how reliable he is. Night in and night out, his offense is there. Curry passes to Bullock. Curry against Murray. Shoots it up. A shot by Curry. No good. High percentage look for him. But bottom line, they're not all going to go down. On to Takumbo with the bucket. I mean, that's a nice find by Murray. He has the height to see the floor, and his awareness continues to grow. Duncan finds Wiggins, and Wiggins throws it down. Straight rim rocker. It looked like a drink for a second, like he might rip the cylinder loose. And it's Murray penetrating. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. And here's Ingles outside. No good on that one. The Warriors go the other way. They easily took Thursday's game. Well, it helps when your opponent makes that many mistakes. I thought that was the story of the game. There were some unforced errors, but they also created some mistakes through their intensity on both ends. Now, here's Oladipo. Tight defense on him. The combination of shooting and speed Oladipo provides this team is invaluable. And his hunger to keep getting better, also impressive. Oladipo hits them both. A little over a minute 30 into this first quarter. Pass to Duncan. To the middle. Here's Buller. And he makes no mistake on the slam dunk. And coach can thank Junior's vision for this one. Watches how the floor is moving and spots the open man. Here's onto Takuma. Oh, yes. But incredible reverse throwdown. Excellent body control. And guys, I'd even go as far to say that was a punctuation dunk. Murray, no good. The Warriors have gone three of four from the field to start out the game. Here's Poole, and it's Golden State with another. I mean, beautiful execution of the game plan offensively. So far, they are hitting 80% from the field. San Antonio's gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Giannis outside, and the slam dunk by Antetokounmpo. And guys, that's a sight we've become far too accustomed to see. Antetokounmpo throwing it down like it was just another day at the office. And they've scored several times already here in the first quarter. Coaching changes in the offseason. So San Antonio going with an almost entirely new group here. We're about three minutes into this first quarter. Here's O'Connor. Wiggins with some nice deep. Warriors have gone five and six so far from the field to start out the game. Here's Duncan. The dunk and the foul. A powerhouse move, and he's got a chance for one more at the line. It's on LaMarcus Aldridge. And you can only admire the grit that Junior plays with. He's not afraid of a little contact. San Antonio making a switch here. He's checked in. Outside, Walker. Here's E. Aldrich kicks to E. Shot clock at five. Johnson outside. Shoots the three. And no good. And it's the Warriors taking it the other way. 
Wiggins passes to Junior, and Duncan throws it down hard. Nice to see Junior rise above the rim. I hope you didn't underestimate his athletic ability. Here's Aldridge. Pass to E. San Antonio again missing. And it's the Warriors ball. They're on a 15-6 run. He gets that one. Finding a little rhythm here that they have to like where they're at. They're playing well. They're building momentum. This is how they can turn a small lead into a big one. Walker dishes to E. Oh, and that one had the right spit on it, and it is good. Working in that mid-range area, the analytics may not love it, but that's a good look for him. Golden State moving the ball around. Duncan, the pass to Curry. That's good, and so Duncan with the assist. Junior's got three assists in the game. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. O'Connor guarded by Curry. O'Connor the pass to Alden. Wiggins against Johnson. Kicks it to E. Duncan with the block. It's tough to get past Junior when he's locked in. Opponents might have to challenge someone else defensively. Both teams will make substitutions. So it's the Spurs now. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. On the court right now for the Spurs. You've got Murray. Under to Kumba out there with Pirtle. Then there's Oladipo. And it's Ingles. And at the three, the small forward. I love Junior's willingness to take advantage of the open floor. That's how you finish on the fast break. All right, let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Alder. Thanks, guys. Junior, in his last outing against the Spurs, was all business. He tallied 25 points and was his usual dominant self on the glass. He put up great numbers in a terrific effort. It's not a game that anyone wanted to miss. And they'll be looking for a repeat performance tonight, Kevin. Okay, David, thanks. It'll be interesting to see, Greg, how much of that performance carries over to tonight. And, Kevin, different scenarios call for different measures. I'm sure he'll just try to provide whatever they need for the win. Well, that's what it means to be unselfish, putting the team's interests first. As you say, he just wants to come away with the W. Eric Pasco, he's checked in for the Warriors. And what an advantage. You really feel like you can always trust him when he's at the line. The Warriors leading. Here's Duncan. Oh, and the jam by Duncan. And that's the kind of dunk that can energize a team. Junior's here to inspire. This is a Dingles. Murray outside. Left side, out of the Kumbo. And it's Junior with the rebound. Duncan's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Terrific assist, a nice finish. Solid play all around. I'm sorry, that's poor defense down low again. It's been a mismatch thus far in the paint. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. Murray surveying the D. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Duncan's got five rebounds tonight. Pascal, the pass to Bullard. And the shot is good. Bullard's got the lead up to eight now for the Warriors. And now you see them starting to really work the ball inside. 32 seconds left in the second quarter. Murray kicks to Giannis. San Antonio again missing. Now the Warriors moving it up. Here's Poole. Over in the corner, Pascal. Puts the move on. And Pirtle sends it back. Gotta love the shot blocking ability of Pirtle. Wonderful timing right there. Giannis up top. 
And again, unable to change momentum here. And so, guys, it's Junior making things happen for the Golden State Warriors. Game two. You look at Junior in this one, he's been everywhere. And he was an absolute monster on the offensive glass in that first half. I don't know how you slow him down. Basketball 101, you've got to put a body on him. Unfortunately, that's a fundamental that's gone by the wayside. Junior's out there with Wiggins. Then there's Bullock. Then there's Stephen Kerr. And it's Poole in at the shooting guard position. That's Steve Kerr's five as we get into the second half. Oladipo, the kick out to Anadokounmpo. Again, Giannis missing. And physically, there's no doubt they've been the stronger team. A plus 10 rebound advantage tells you all you need to know. Clearly a foul. And he's got his first free throw of the game. He throw good, Wiggins. And the winner's mentality Wiggins has is commendable. A hard worker who wants to keep improving. Spurs trail by 14. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Murray against Kerr. Over in the corner, out of the Kumbo. It's three pointers off the mark. Golden State's gone three of five from beyond the arc so far tonight. Here's Poole. Offline with his three. And so it's Murray who brings the ball up for the San Antonio Spurs. And there's the bucket from Victor Oladipo. Oladipo's got seven points in the game. Yeah, this is light work for Oladipo. Uh, if the D doesn't force him out of that area, they're done. And it goes down two points. And at the offensive end, he's done about as much as they could have hoped for today. For San Antonio, they've gone one of three since starting the second half. San Antonio calls timeout. Yeah, just looking to tighten up their defense in the paint. Here's Johnson. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. He kicks it to Walker. It's good with the assist that time from Johnson. Walker's got a pair of threes now here in the third for the Spurs. Now here's Curry. Defense right on him. To the inside. And Junior throws it down. There's no stopping Junior right now. He's on an absolute tear and just torching the deep. Here's the pass to Alden. The dish to Johnson. Outside, Walker. The tray. And again, it's San Antonio with a three. And really, as the three-pointers keep dropping, you get the sense that the frustration is mounting for the defense. Here's Flores. A rebound by the Spurs. I didn't see that miss coming. I mean, he's usually been money from that range. Astro O'Connor. Johnson outside. Aldridge, the pass to E. No good off the back of the rim. You know what? He's just stone cold right now. Really not sure if he's their best option offensively as they try to get back in this game. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Duncan outside. Pass to Curry. Some nice passing by Golden State. The shot's good. And the Warriors lead by 16. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. Three-pointer. Nailed from three-point land. Curry's got 13 points in the second half. Stephen Curry with the pull-up jump shot. You cannot back off him. He will score. This is what you practice every day. These guys are professionals. Beautiful play. What an atmosphere in here as we return to the action of the Western Conference Final. A moment now to reset the lineups. Back to us by Gatorade. All fueled up here for the fourth quarter. On the court right now for the Spurs. They've got Turtle. Wingles is out there with Johnson. Then there's Oladipo, and it's O'Connor in at the point guard position. Passes it to O'Connor. Ingles in the corner. There's the triple. It's good from long range. Defensively, they just look out of sync, not closing out on the threes in time. And Junior throws it down. Not surprised at all. He's shooting it well and scoring points in budgets. Kicks 
to Johnson. And again, it's the Spurs from deep. That's a dozen straight points coming off the triple. Warriors leading by 17. Down low, it's stolen by Johnson. And the Spurs pushing it up now. A wide open look here for Oladipo. Off target from outside. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Here's Junior, the pass to Poole. Back to Duncan. And Junior throws it down. And where is the defense? Junior just knifing his way to the hoop like there's no one else out there. Johnson, wide open, he fires. And they cash in right away with the quick shot. Timeout, Curry's checked in. So it's the Warriors now. Duncan outside. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Higgins passes to Junior. And the dunk by Duncan. An unselfish wing who continues to evolve as a playmaker. Wiggins shows he's more than just the score. Pass to Oladipo. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. Murray's got four assists in the game. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. Here's Wiggins, and it's Wiggins with the jam. Good vision from Steph. But for that play to work, you also have to get open. Steph put it on the money. Giannis right up. And it's San Antonio with another. And just using the natural advantage he has, he can see over the top of the defense. And let's also add, he has touch from there. That's a solid shot for him. And a wide open look here for Wiggins. And another three for Golden State. And pretty consistent from range. Wiggins has the natural tools to do a little bit of everything. They get the rebound. And the way they have controlled the glass this game, really impressive. You know, you look at how they built this lead. It's been through extra possessions. Mm -hmm. To the paint. Pass to pool. And out of bounds as San Antonio gains possession. You want unselfishness, but you also need to keep it under control. And we just got a second look there at the exceptional mobile one block. And it's a different kind of defense teams play in the postseason. More in-your-face, physical, high-energy plays like that. Back to Murray from the arc. A three-pointer is right on target. This just comes from repetition. Murray's put a lot of extra hours in the gym, catching and firing. Warriors leading by 17. Out left of the wing. Here's Poole, guarded by Oladipo. And the shot goes in from Bowler. And, and that's just about going to wrap it up for game number. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Aldridge dishes to Grant. A floater. A new 14-second shot clock for San Antonio. Duncan and Duncan throws it down. Oh, big finish. Emphatic. He hangs on the rim just for good measure. <laughs> 56 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Outside, Green. Passes to Grant from 13. Again, the miss by the Spurs. And here's Duncan. He'll bring it up for the Warriors. A 21-point lead, the biggest in the game. And Junior throws it down. And, and it's just competing. And, you know, giving your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. Eight-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Loads it up for Junior. On the dunk by Duncan. An impressive job by the players, coaches, and don't discount the impact of these fans. They gave the team tremendous energy tonight. The fans were fantastic. It was a true home court advantage. Grant kicks to Walker. There's Green with the three. 
The Warriors pull it in. Here's Wanamaker. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. And this win puts them squarely in the driver's seat in the series. Up now, Greg, two zip with all the momentum on their side. I mean, in fantastic shape right now. If they can capitalize on this victory and win game three, you can just about put this series to bed. You got it. That concludes this broadcast of the Western Conference Finals. Now for Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching.